Hello everyone, welcome to uh, another video and today I'm going to just say this first at the date of recording and probably the day of release of this video October 31st of 2020 this update is not out for console players so you will not be able to do a tail whip you will not be able to do a bar spin and you will not be able to do a table and you will not have the new bikes so first of all, if you are on PC, and this is for the Steam version only of the game, because the way that the uh, Microsoft Store version works, it's basically just a uh, console port of the Xbox version of the game. Uh, what you want to do is press X or press Square, uh, depending on what controller you use, and then choose the downhill, uh, not the downhill bike, the dirt jumper. Uh, you have uh, also a selection of the enduro bike which is basically what you will have on console right now the enduro is no different to the standard bike it is the standard bike and uh, the new downhill bike has new it has like a new bit of weight system and it rides differently and it's a bit quicker as well than any of any of any other of the bikes so what you want to get on is literally the dirt jumper once you're on that obviously choose whatever bike skin that you would like and then go for a ride. Um, basically what I'm going to show you is all the new tricks. I'm just going to go up here because it gives you enough speed for a jump to do pretty much every trick I'm pretty sure. Uh, and set a marker. Uh, so for the bar spin all you want to do is press L1 and push the right stick to the right. That is literally all you have to do. It's, it's the same as doing a knack knack on the regular bike. Uh, it's genuinely just hop, press L1 and then press right on the right stick you can see with the little controller in the bottom right corner that is how it works for the tail whip it's the same as the can can all you have to do is press L1 and push down and right or down and left on the right stick um, it's like you know the diagonal movement I suppose you could say uh, it also works in oppo um, so you can do oppo whips if you want uh, same with you can also do oppo bars that also works with the tuck no hander it's the same way as you do a no hander he just tucks up now with this bike so it's just a different trick and the same for a table it literally replaces the candy bar and that's how tables work all you have to do is just do the same way you do a candy bar which is up and right or up and left and then for the final one which is a superman seat grab it is the same way as doing a superman really um, that is just how all the new tricks work it's very simple this is just a really short video on because people ask me this every single stream uh, ignore the front flip uh, on how it works and it is really just the same as every other trick there isn't like a new way you don't like do how you would do a shove it in a game at the moment you can't double bar unless you do bar to bar because it doesn't allow you to carry on doing a bar spin it doesn't do two bar spins or two tail whips you can't double whip or anything like that it will count as a whip to whip or a bar to bar if you ever get a double because you have to do the input twice they are ever so slightly delayed it feels you really need to be in the air before you do the trick otherwise it doesn't register but that is just how it works um I hope this cleared up most of the thing. I'm sorry this is really short, but this is literally all that it is. It's very simple. It's the same as doing every other trick in every other on every other bike and the bikes that you already have. So if you're used to doing the tricks on the enduro bike uh, or on the regular bike, uh, a bar spin will just be a knack knack. And you can throw these into a numerous amounts of tricks. 360 backflip tail whip. It literally works all the time with every other trick. It is super simple and it isn't difficult at all. Uh, I hope this helped. I'm sorry that this update isn't out. They hope that it should come out before Christmas this year. Uh, that is a big if. We don't actually know. It depends on how development with the consoles go because developing for a console is a bit harder than developing for PC. So yeah, um, I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope this helped. I hope this is all cleared up now and people understand uh, what's going on and how it all works and how to do all the new tricks. Um, it is very simple and uh, I hope this cleared everything up. I'm sorry for the console people that don't have the update yet, but for you Steam users, I hope you enjoy this and I will see you lot later. Goodbye.